Each day, the U.S. Naval Surface Force sails the globe. Prepare to defend the ship! Dispersed, beyond homeland and sea, vigilant and ready, their constant presence keeps the world's oceans free for all nations to prosper. Fast mover inbound, deploy countermeasures. For a maritime nation to maintain its sea power edge, control must endure from space to seafloor, across all domains and dimensions. Killing track 05877 with birds. To send forth a naval power of this magnitude, our greatest leaders must employ our most lethal weapons with exacting precision. One decision at a time. Roger out. But where does the certainty a decision can mean victory come from? The Navy has both a tradition and a future, and we must look with pride and confidence in both directions. From the earliest and most ancient seafarer, an unbroken line of expert ship handling and circumnavigation can be traced to the command of the most junior officer conning a warship this very moment. Basic tactics developed and advanced through the years has allowed our Navy to emerge as the modern fighting force it is today. And now it is sea control by design, which stands as the hallmark for everything we do as a naval force. Elemental to safeguarding this sea control against all potential threats is the organizational framework of tactics, talent, tools, and training. These four tenets start at the most junior level of every officer's career and are developed and built upon as a foundation for continued growth and expertise. It is an organizational system that serves as the mechanism by which our surface force forges the tip of the spear. While active ships are maintained and equipped, the fleet of tomorrow is already in development. The design, procurement, and fielding of these capabilities are realized through investments that span decades. Meanwhile, sailors and officers increase their knowledge as they advance through their careers and progress through their training continuums. And our cadre of standout talent develop tactics or teach those who will one day become their relief. Continual upgrades to virtual training environments that replicate the complexity of shipboard evolutions deliver skillful operators capable of fighting and winning in the 21st century and beyond. Research and development teams using innovative techniques such as modeling and simulation inspire leaders to expand the breadth of our future force by capturing and challenging the most creative minds. This process infuses the fleet with collaboration, innovation, and diversity of thought that fortifies ethics and emboldens warfighting ethos. But sea control is not exhaustive command over the world's oceans, nor is its strategic presence of equipment or technology. It is the commitment that wherever and whenever called upon, we will be ready compounding industry's tools, drilling procedures to perfection, and empowering our best talent makes our fleet as agile as it is dependable. These are the keys to aligning the surface force strategy. Sir, out the station. But good ideas must be driven into practice with courageous patience. Mark. And a weapons trajectory begins well before it's fired. Prepare to destroy all enemy. Surface warfare professionals, capable of safely driving ships to the far corners of the earth, cutting edge technologies, and weapons systems helmed by stalwart leaders are needed to safeguard our nation and ensure the Navy remains the surest guarantee of peace. Execute. Batteries release. But when peace fails, we must answer the call and we must answer decisively. Inflicting damage of such magnitude, the adversary is rendered totally incapable of further aggression. If we must fight, then we will win. Today, tomorrow, 